The man suspected in an apparent assassination attempt against former President Trump now faces federal gun charges. Law enforcement officials accuse Ryan Wesley Routh of pointing a gun at Trump yesterday while the presidential nominee was golfing. Manuel Bajorquez has the latest from West Palm Beach, Florida, where officials just held a press conference. <laughs> Police body camera video shows the moment Florida deputies arrested Ryan Wesley Ruth about 50 miles north of former President Donald Trump's West Palm Beach Golf Club on Sunday. He never so much as asked what's going on. He just sat there really like he was going to a picnic. Monday, the 58-year-old appeared in federal court as the FBI investigates the apparent assassination attempt on Trump. For now, Ruth's charged with possession of a firearm as a convicted felon and possession of a firearm with an obliterated serial number. Additional charges are possible. In court, Ruth calmly answered the judge's questions and appeared relaxed to the point of smiling in a conversation he had with the court-appointed public defender. Prosecutors believe Ruth was targeting Trump as the former president was playing golf about 300 to 500 yards away. A Secret Service agent spotted the gun muzzle peeking through the perimeter tree line and fired at it. According to court documents, Ruth fled, leaving behind an AK-47 style rifle, a scope, a digital camera, two bags, and a plastic bag with food. Phone records put him in the wooded area for nearly 12 hours. The subject, who did not have line of sight to the former president, fled the scene. He did not fire or get off any shots at our agent. But the Secret Service is under new scrutiny, especially after the July attempt on Trump's life. There is no place in political violence for political violence in America. None. Zero. The head of the Secret Service went to Mar-a-Lago to brief former President Trump. Manuel Bajorquez, CBS News, West Palm Beach, Florida. Ruth is scheduled to be back in court next Monday. Former President Trump is scheduled to hold his next campaign event in Michigan tomorrow, Wednesday. He'll be in Long Island, New York, and officials there have announced new security measures.